Hey everybody, welcome back to Avid Max Gear Reviews. My name is Steve. Today we're gonna to do a quick one for you, checking out the assortment of tailout tools from Scientific Anglers. All right, everybody, we're going to give you an overview of all of the tools in the tailout assortment, uh, talk about the features and benefits of them. Um, before we get into specific models, um, all across the board, these are stainless tools and they have a nice rubberized comfy grip on there. It's definitely a nice aspect, kind of moves them up a tier from a lot of the baseline or standard uh, tools that you're gonna find available. Starting out all the way to the left here with the tailout standard clamp. This is a five and three quarter inch clamp. Moving from the bottom to the top, again, has that nice comfy grip finish on there. This is kind of your standard issue loop style handle. Um, you have a hidden hook eye cleaner. And then the clamp itself is nice because it features a smooth area on the tip moving down to a textured or serrated area lower down on the clamp. Uh, the reason that I think this is kind of the best of both worlds is if you only have that serrated or textured area, um, it can be hard to line those up in just the right way to pinch a barb or something like that. So by having smooth at the tip, moving into that textured area on the clamp, um, I feel like you're really getting kind of the whole package um, with that clamp option. Moving on to the tail out scissor clamp. This is the same length, kind of built on the same platform as the standard with the addition of that scissored serrated area just beneath the clamp. Um, this is nice because it's gonna cover your bases for most of your leader and tippet knots. Um, kind of covers, I would say, like 90% of your line cutting, tippet cutting situations. Um, so if you're trying to save yourself time or um, hassle for reaching for your nipper or something that's a little bit more precise, this is gonna cover a lot of your um, situations that way. So nice option there. Moving on into the tail out mitten scissor clamp. Uh, this has got the same features that we just talked about with both the clamp and the scissor um, with just a different handle style. So this is kind of my preferred configuration. Not that I'm fishing with mittens all the time, but I just find that being able to operate this easily with um, my hand kind of in this comfortable position rather than splitting my fingers up to do that loop style. Uh, this easily clamps and then if you need to release it, you can simply pull through. Um, and that's just a lot easier to operate generally, um, I find, than the loop style. So uh, you also have attachment points, little ports on the sides of the handle so you can put it on your favorite lanyard, zinger, retractor, or piece of gear that you want to use it on. You still have a hidden hook eye cleaner and the scissor, and the clamp moving from textured towards smooth at the tip. Now getting into the different nipper options that we have, there's a standard nipper as well as a carbide nipper um, for the blade. That carbide blade just has better edge retention and longevity than the standard. Um, both of them have an attachment point, again, to put it on any piece of retaining gear that you wanna put it on. And then the hook eye cleaner on the nipper is totally hidden and recessed in that little area. Makes it so that you're not gonna catch it on a finger or a piece of gear, a waiter pocket, something like that. It's a nice oversized nipper with a kind of a negative space area, so you get a good positive grip on there. Um, makes everything comfy, easy to use, and very simple. Moving on uh, to the tail out hook file. Again, with that nice textured comfy grip on there, makes it nice if you have a cold or wet hand. Um, you've got two sides to this, both the coarse and the fine. If you're lucky enough to be able to use the same fly for repeated uh, drifts, you're probably either catching multiple fish or multiple pieces of the bottom and the bank. Either way, you need to keep your hook sharp and this allows you to do so. The whole cherry on top for this lineup of tools is the tail out assortment. Whether you're an experienced angler or guide and you just want to have a backup set because you don't want dropping something into the river to ruin your day, um, this is a great 
option for that. And it's also a great option if you're looking to get into fly fishing or gift uh, a set of tools to somebody getting into fly fishing who may not know what are the core things that they need. This had you covered. It has the standard clamp, the very first one that we talked about, the standard nipper, and a nice zinger on there to kind of keep things handy and from getting lost. So something for everybody in the tail out lineup of tools from scientific anglers. Thanks for watching this video, we appreciate it. If you liked it, make sure to throw us a like. If you wanna see something specific from us on this channel, go ahead and leave us a comment and let us know what you think. And if you like the channel, please subscribe. We definitely appreciate it. Thanks guys.